We all know learning is a good practice, but constant learning, even when the need is not felt, is a great practice. Welcome to Thank God It's a Story Saturday, a weekly video series where I share stories with you that you can use to make your messages stick. The year is 1950. Juan Manuel Fangio, an Argentinian car racing driver, is in Monaco to compete in the Grand Prix. He's on the track and just before the blind tobacco corner, he makes a decision to exit the chicane. Chicane essentially is a double bend created on the car racing track as an obstacle for the car racing drivers. Now his reaction to exit the chicane is a counterintuitive reaction. Most car racing drivers actually increase the speed at that time to gain momentum. But it is his this reaction that saves his life. Because out of his sight, ahead of the blind to back corner, cars are piled up on top of each other and an accident has taken place. Now one may wonder, how did he know to stop and exit the chicane? When asked, Fangio reveals that a night before the car racing, he had seen a photograph of a similar accident in 1936. He observed in the photograph that when an accident like that takes place, the color of the crowd changes. What does that mean? That means is that if the driver is on the car racing track, you would normally in your peripheral vision notice the crowd cheering and you see the color of the crowd is that of their face. But in this case, the color of the crowd changes because the crowd is looking at the accident. So in his peripheral vision, he noticed the back of their head, which gave him the indication that something else was grabbing their attention and an accident might have taken place. That is why he exited the chicane. Now, this story tells us that when we learn, we should constantly learn, not because we feel the need for it, but just because we are curious and keen learners, so that when the time comes, we can scan the signals of change and apply the knowledge.